Next on Up North Live, News at 6, some potentially good news for the Cherry Capital, how a new fund could help northern Michigan growers. Could Michigan wetlands be at risk? Why the Line 5 tunnel project stirring up more controversy tonight? A live report from tonight's Trump rally, what the president's expected to say and how Democrats are responding. A salute to Michigan frontliners, why Governor Whitmer's new initiative could make Michigan a model of the Midwest. And we introduce you to another Northern Michigan family we're following through a very different school year. This is Up North Live News at 6 on 7 and 4. Tonight at 6, Congress is providing another $14 billion to the U.S. Department of Agriculture that will help with a second round of payments to farmers nationwide. Up North Live's Brittany Beauty was there as Northern Michigan farmers voiced their concerns to the USDA. The Northern Michigan region produces two-thirds of tart cherries in the U.S. And while that's quite a bit, tart cherry growers are still one of the smallest groups in U.S. agriculture, which is why it's a pretty big deal that the Undersecretary for Farm Production and Conservation of the USDA made a trip here to Leelanau County. He's going to go back to D.C. and he's going to sit around the table and they're going to figure out which industries need to get these limited funds. The tart cherry industry is just one of the industries that did not qualify for the first round of the coronavirus food assistance program.